1031 iHeart Austin and iHeart Radio. I'm Nerf here and I'm with Young the Giant. How you guys doing? Good. Pretty good. How you doing? Good, man. You guys are on little sleep, right? You know, like uh, I saw you guys last night. You tore it up at Stubbs. Uh, amazing performance. Really, really good. Thank you. Uh, and and you know, and I was a, a little worried because I know you've been you've been pretty sick. You know, like uh, uh, you, you've had bronchitis. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> like, uh, like uh, how, how are you feeling? You like everything? Everything good? Good. Yeah. You know, I'm just bouncing back right now. It's best not to think about it anymore. I just I was. <laughs> Sick for like two weeks, so I'm like, I'm just. It'll go away it. if you don't look at it. Exactly. Right. Exactly. The bronchitis will just leave on exactly. its own. Right on. That's cool. And and like, is there things you do to take care of your voice while you're on tour? Because like, I, I mean, it's you know, you can't have a show if you can't sing, right? I mean, so. Yeah, I try. You know, it's like, on tour inherently is just you know rough on your voice. You just gotta choose certain things to do correctly, and and say screw it. To the other things, <laughs> right? Just, you know, choose your battles. Yeah, totally. So, um, my uh, la last time I interviewed you guys, it, uh, I believe I had my kids write the interview, and uh, so I wanted to mix it up a little this time. I I, uh, I found a hobo and had him awesome. write. No, I'm just kidding. Oh. I took a picture with an, with a great. I, I don't know if he's homeless, but he was wearing a diaper. Oh, really? Yesterday, and and he had. That's actually in right now. A very uh, few teeth. <laughs> we just saw a couple with automatic rifles. With like American flag T-shirts and, and a baby holding a baby, and you know, a baby. It, it's usually it's Austin, not Texas, yeah. right? You know, like but uh, sometimes Texas creeps in, I guess. Yeah. You know, it's like uh, like that sounds very very Texas to me. Yeah. So now you guys uh, have uh, played South by Southwest before. You got like a, you know stranger to it. Uh, like what's changed since uh, the first times? Maybe you played South by to like uh, uh, did you play with the Jakes or? Um? Yeah, we we played the first time as the Jakes, and I think. One of the big differences was uh, we weren't allowed in anywhere because we were all underage. And uh, I think another thing I've noticed, we've been here three times and the first time was maybe five years ago or so. And it seems to be, at least uh, from my standpoint, that the first time we came it seemed to be more industry people and and more unsigned acts maybe and now there it seems to be a lot of signed acts and still still a lot of unsigned music but um it's going corporate. Yeah, it's, it's big, and there's so many people, and there was a lot of people. It's still the first a lot year. of fun. I mean, you know, I have seen some very independent artists. In fact, I was at your at your show. I was hanging out with some that were just in the crowd too. So it's like you do meet those uh, those yeah. artists. They're around definitely. Absolutely. Uh, that's cool. Now the um, uh, your your song. I wanted to ask you one more question about uh, it's about time. When. Uh, like I've listened to the album, and the album has some stuff uh, that if you liked the previous album, you would definitely love. It definitely progresses. It's like a, it's a it's a new thing. But uh, you know, I'd say it's about time is like a very up tempo, a very powerful song, and a little atypical for you guys. Like why lead with that as the first single? I think we just wanted to show people and prove to ourselves that we're a very dynamic band. We have the ability to do. Um, a lot of different things and we don't want to necessarily put ourselves in a box um, and that should be what hopefully people can expect and hope for us for the next couple of years as we continue our careers to you know always kind of change our sound but still have it be Young the Giant. Mind Over Matter, great album if you don't have it you need to go get it. It's very, very good. And and thank you guys so much for being here. What's uh, are you done? Is this uh? Yeah, we just this was actually a pretty easy South by for us. Got two shows. Just kind of fun, you know. Flew in, did two shows. Got some press today. Hanging out for the rest of the day, catching some bands. The rest is just eating migas, right? Oh yeah. Yeah. Right on. Thank you guys so much for being here. Thank much you. appreciated. It's 1031 iHeart Austin. I'm Nerf with Young the Giant.